Neuroplastic anemia is a, a rare but serious uh, bone marrow disorder where the bone marrow essentially fails to produce blood cells normally. It occurs with an instance of only about one or two per million per year, so it's an extremely rare condition. And what happens is that the bone marrow slows down, it stops producing all the blood cells, so it's no longer making enough numbers of red blood cells, white cells and platelets and the impact on patients can be quite profound. It can result in severe anemia, uh, resulting in the patient feeling very tired, no energy. It results in low white cell count, so patients lose their natural protection against infections. And uh, when the platelet count falls to very low levels, patients can start to bleed spontaneously without any trauma. The platelets are essential blood cells that stop us bruising and bleeding. And whilst this can cause maybe just skin bleeding, it can also cause more serious bleeding, sometimes in the brain or in the bowels. There are other types of aplastic anemia where patients can present with not such a dramatic fall in the blood counts, what we call uh, non-severe or milder uh, moderate aplastic anemia. And although the blood counts are low, they're not as low as in the severe, the most severe form. If patients are not treated and they have severe aplastic anemia, then patients can actually die from this condition if left untreated. For that reason, it's a very serious condition and does require, you know, early prompt treatment.